so like, like other experiences of teen camp well when i was a nipper um it was just a chance to meet together with with other christians and get away from home and as i got older it's just a chance to um share christianity with younger people um it's kind of like the um the bakewell tart of christian experiences i'd say i don't know what you think john <laughs> Um, for me, it's a very different experience. I um, I only came to the camp for the first time last year. I'd not even heard of it up until um, just over a year ago. Um, one of my best friends said about how he'd gone as a camper and had a great time. And you know, I didn't really know what to expect, but I came along and um, you know, so much, uh, so many great kids, such a great experience. The whole week meeting with God and all the fun side and the activity side, and you know. Um, you know, I absolutely had to come back this year and sort of signed up straight away and uh, hope to continue to go if I can. Okay. What do the benefits does Teen Camp provide for young people? The benefits to provide? Um, I think that, uh, from my point of view, I think the, the kids get a lot of benefits. A lot of them um, come from quite small churches with small youth groups. They get to meet a lot of kids their own age, um, sort of in similar situations, but also in different situations. There's a real wide variety of them, and it's strange how at the beginning of the week they all, you know, they all seem quite different, but by the end they really bond, and there's some great friendships. If you actually, you know, if you look on Facebook and you see them all chatting throughout the year and stuff like that, you know, it's a real... A real base for friendships for them, um, and you know, there's obviously other benefits as well. Um, mm, mm. So, what do you think? Well, it's a little bit like the Great Escape, really, in that they can um, they can get away from home and just have a, a different, vibrant um, experience. Get away from their parents. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> what do you think is unique about the wet teen camp compared with other camps? Well, well, the brilliant thing about teen camp is that it's, um, as you can see, it's it's all under canvas which makes kids realise how great it is to be at home. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it yeah. kind of gets you close to nature. Yeah, yeah. And it makes you appreciate how wonderful so, it is. Character to have a building. House. Yeah, it's character, building. Yeah, it was character so. building. Yeah, I think I aged about yeah. 10 years in my first time. <laughs> <laughs> Came in as a little 12 year old, I left yeah. as a 22 year old. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I had that 100 yard stair thing. And I'm yeah. probably on a more serious side. It's quite, <laughs> it's, you know, quite, quite different. What to, do you mean? Uh, Sorry. <laughs> and then, you know, actually what the content of the camp is. It's quite different to other camps in that it's got a very strong missionary focus. Obviously, a lot of the people who lead and do the talks are kind of from a missionary background or have links with missionaries. A lot of the families that stay here are missionary focused. And, you know, I've never been aware of any other camps that have had that sort of focus. So I think that's, you know, a great thing about the camp. Gosh, oh. I, I had no idea. <laughs> Sure I should really go to the evening meeting. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, John, you've convicted me. Right, what would you say to a church Thanks leader, or a church leader or youth leader, to get them encouraged to get their young people on, on the camp? <laughs> <laughs> well, John's here, and he's a great role model. I think when Christians come together in a group, you just get a chance... To, to hear the word taught, you get a chance to experience uh, the Christian community around other Christians and just see that, that, that Christianity is relevant, it's real, and that there are younger people who believe it, um, who are all right. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Apart from John. Um, <laughs> okay, now we're trying to encourage a youth leader to come. Youth, uh, so oh, a youth to, leader to come oh, as yeah. a leader? Or, uh, well, or youth uh, leader to, bring, to, bring it, to bring his youngsters. Right, okay. Oh. And okay. the he's not sending his youngsters, bringing his youngsters. He's oh, bringing yeah. them. Oh, because he'd come with them. Yeah, oh, okay. Uh, let's yeah, start yeah, again. So, yeah, let's start, yeah, start again. Well, you okay. start again. Uh, okay. And what, I, what I'd probably say to the um, the youth leader would be that um, the actual atmosphere here is, is absolutely fantastic. Um, I'd say it was a real sort of nourishing and time for growth for their kids. Um, I think it's something that they don't necessarily get they might not get their own youth group um, and as I say you know the the activities themselves are fantastic the teaching is great um, and I think that I mean all, all they'd probably have to do would be to talk to any of the other kids that have been in the past and they'd kind of get a, a feeling for how good the camp was so um, I mean personally I, I would just harp on about it to them but uh, you know that's just me so I don't know about um, you I mean if, if you're a youth group leader it, it would be a missed opportunity not not to come here with them because mm. a you get the fellowship from the other leaders on the camp mm. and secondly you get to spend a lot of time and really build strong relationships with the campers as you live by them day by day mm. and you could probably you're probably going to get a year's contact time w within one week yeah. at team camp the, there's a lot of time that for the you know the the real deep discussions the conversations about stuff because they're away from their home they can uh, they can have the discussions that they you know might not feel as comfortable about at home and also on top of that i'd say um you know as a youth leader it's 
probably got to look after your kids most of the time as well as you get get a bit more free time when you come here you've got plenty of other leaders to kind of do a bit of your job and it's probably you know there is plenty of free time i'd say i like yeah. the free time and free time to win probably most importantly there is a there is a tuck shop yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah That's some really good sweets <laughs> quite expensive <laughs> in one sentence what does team camp meant to you personally um A bit like a designer label, wouldn't you yeah. say, John? <laughs> in one sentence. Uh, in one sentence, I would say Team Cap means to me um, it's about friendship, uh, togetherness, um, kind of growth in my sort of Christian life in ways that, you know, I probably can't get at home. So that's what I'd say. For me, Team Camp is basically a chance to serve the Great Commission, to share my knowledge and my faith in Jesus Christ with young people so they might come to, to knowledge of him or, or grow in knowledge of him to be more effective and what's the whole point of the church well it's, it's to bring glory to God that's why excellent yeah. excellent mm. Good. Brilliant, that's great guys. Thanks okay. very much. Yeah, Thank wonderful. You. Didn't get many film titles and you let me down big time. <laughs> I, I'm sure we might find a scrap of bit or two in that one. <laughs> <laughs> You've probably got about four seconds. Yeah, <laughs> that's great, thanks.